Hi, my name is Eric Parks. I am a professor here at uh, Fringe University, the Kansas City campus. Um, I do supervision as well as instruction. And in addition to that, and why I'm actually speaking to you today, is I was the founder of and the manager of a nonprofit uh, mental health clinic in Atchison, Kansas called Hope Family Therapy. As such, we use uh, students from Fringe University as interns, so it's a placement site, and it's where you'll get to practice your clinical skills, or one of the locations you'll get to practice your clinical skills when you're here in the program. So when you go out to a site, and there's 24, 25 sites, they're always changing in numbers, and that's part of what makes Fringe Uni University unique, is we already have relationships with these sites. And so it allows you to not have to go chase one down. Um, we'll help you get there. And when you come to these sites, we have people that are trained as mentors. Um, there's two different kinds of mentors in this program. There are what we call clinical mentors and non-clinical mentors, because some of your sites actually are working clinics and some of your sites may be churches or other locations that don't have mental health people on staff. And so what the mentor's role is to one, um, academically make sure you're showing up and completing your task, getting your paperwork completed, and just giving general feedback to the program. What we really like to do is what one of our mentors one time, Tom said was soul care. And, and so that's actually checking in with you and finding out how are you doing at the site um, and how are you doing as you go through this program and seeing how we can help you be more successful. And so that's really what mentoring is, is a person on site where you're doing your clinical work. They're gonna be your primary point of contact. They're going to be the person that does the scoring of and feedback of your work there for the academic part of it. But really they're that personal contact to make sure you're doing well, uh, your needs are being met at the site. And then additionally at the clinical sites, even add some clinical expertise to the experience that you have um, when you're out at the sites.